Hey there, Blue Moon Estate Sales Shoppers. We are out here in beautiful Maryville, not too far off of Morganton Road on Farmington. I'm showing you this wide, wide uh, yard here because this is parking for you. We will have an attendant telling you where to park, um, but there'll be plenty of parking. So let's um, start here on the front porch and show you the treasures that await you. We have this epic front porch here for you with some beautiful fall decor, some nice antique chairs. Christmas is coming. We've got the, the wreaths, just a couple of rockers, items, a little barrel, got a nice charbroil grill, um, kind of like a church pew type of deal, and all kinds of antique tools on the side of the porch, including my favorite uh, this, you know, whetstone with a cool little tractor seat for you to do your grind in here. And then, of course, over here we have a few more items. When you first enter in the front door here, you see a nice tall rustic Santa. Cute little rocking chair. We got some baby dolls. Uh, please note there is nothing for sale upstairs. So this is all the lower level. We do have a set of four nice basset chairs here. And you see the decor is really nice cabin style, very Native American in style. Uh, these great copper pieces here that surround the hearth and the wood stove. And perhaps my very favorite piece is this um, canoe table here, coffee table. So as we just continue around, lots of little collectibles, ball jars, moccasins, um, got a nice uh, tapestry, quilt ladder, and some decor here. Lots more Native American. You know, we've got some weapons and some dream catchers. Just all sorts of fun collectibles. And this is a nice secretary piece, a little teepee. Um, this is an adorable tractor seat, um, high top table here. So cute. Got some cactuses, some more Native American. Um, of course, that's um, Ron Hampton. And then over here, we do have that really cool spiral lamp. Um, this crazy looking thing, it looks like something out of a um, Hobbit house or something. I really like it. And then we've got the hover round scooter if you need to get around a little easier. Um, cute little chairs. And then these are um, electric uh, chairs here. And some more baby dolls and another chair. Heading into the primary bedroom here, we do have some handbags and some blankets. Uh, the bedroom set here is Broyhill. It is gorgeous, really nice quality. And you'll see several pieces of that. Um, this is a little jewelry case for sale. So if you want to store your jewelry inside, um, that would be pretty cool. We've got some clothing in the closet. Uh, an array of cleaning tools here, vacuums, some nice hand-carved walking sticks, um, another quilt ladder here, and then we have this um, blue armchair. So this is some more of the Broyhill pieces. Please note that there's glass on the top, so the um, condition is very well preserved at the top. Um, we have this bed here, and then this is some lighting that has been taken down and just kind of placed here for, for safety so you don't get stabbed in the shin as you're walking around the house. Um, but it would look really nice as a chandelier um, lighting in a cabin or a rustic home. We've got some more art over here, a few longer burger baskets, lots of little light up churches. And then this is the uh, Broyhill dresser here and Tiffany style lamp. And we've got some more art here. All right, moving on to the living room here. We have this um, large piece here for media and then lots of pretty cool collectible media here. Lots of Disney, VHS, 
some DVD. That's more Broyhill. Um, we have the sofa, and then we're still sorting through the jewelry here, but you can kind of see a sampling of what some of the jewelry will be. Um, Thanksgiving's around the corner, so we have an entire Thanksgiving dishware set if you're hosting. Um, you can be impress your, your guests with your themed uh, place settings here. We do have some collectible coins. And then as we come around over here, we've got some nice decor, some more holiday. We've got the nativity set going on here. Um, into the kitchen, make sure you watch your step. I think all of us have tripped um, at least a dozen times. Um, there is the step to the kitchen, but we have some good stuff, so it's worth the hazard there. Uh, we've got gizmos and gadgets and pots and pans, and then the nice blue dansk set. Um, very sturdy type stuff. And then some more copperware, which is always cute and some household type stuff. Right outside the kitchen, we've got our bakeware, some holiday glasses and collectible plates. We have some cabinets here. And then as we get a little closer to the checkout, we're gonna be having more jewelry here for you. We're still getting set up. We have these really nice um, Civil War knives. And of course, Smokey, have a little bit of ammo here at the checkout. Um, and then got the garage and outside to show you still. All right, I just entered the garage. We've got all the cleaning supplies you might need. We have um, a wooden play table here for kids. Um, some shelving, a little bit of fishing, lots of Christmas. And then down here, some more cleaning, vintage toys. So we've got the uh, train sets here, which looks like fun. Uh, super wooden train set, wow. I might have to get that for my four-year-old. Um, I'll give you all first dibs, but if it's still there at the end of the day, it's fair game. Uh, we've got the Frigidaire refrigerator here. And let's see, some decor and light bulbs, lots more Christmas. We've got a uh, Waterloo vintage chest here. Um, one of my favorite pieces here is the Predator generator. So um, any of you guys that have been through a big storm know what it's like to live without power. It's always good to have one of those guys handy. Uh, we've got more cleaning, some jacks, all kinds of garage goodies. And we have some vehicles I'm going to share with you as well. We do have some vehicles here for sale. This is a 1988 Grand Prix. Um, this one is in running condition. I'm asking $1,500 or best offer. Um, this, these two cars are definitely project cars. 1993 GMC Sonoma, not running. Um, and then this thing, maybe yard art, maybe parts. I don't know, it's pretty rough. Um, but hey, if you want it, I'm sure we can make a deal. And then, this thing is pretty cool. It is a um, 1950s um, Ford tractor, the 900 series. So that is pretty cool, $2,500 um, or best offer on it. So we can't wait to see you out here um, in Maryville on Farmington Road, Friday, Saturday, come say hi.